eyes. Hey. How are you feeling? Um. Oh, like uh, somebody ran over my, my god with a lawnmower. Uh, that would be us. <sighs> you are hemorrhaging. Claire, I just stopped bleeding. Claire. She saved your life. We want to give you some painkillers. We give you something uh, local, but when that wears off. No. Mm -hmm. No. I want to have a clear head. Oh. 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 Just give me your hand. Give me your hand. I may never let go. Good. Ow. Sorry. Don't. Don't. He's awake. I'm just gonna do a quick check. I'll leave you two alone after that, okay? Okay. <clears throat> Much better. He's doing okay. Must have been tempting. Just let me die. My daughter loves you. That's all that matters. I'm glad you're okay, Danny. I was so scared. So scared I was gonna lose you. You can never let that happen. Okay. No, I won't. You can never, ever, ever okay. leave me, please. No, never. sleeping. Hey, good job. What? Your fever broke. How are you feeling? Like, terrible. Huh. A little hungry. I guess that's good, huh? Yeah, I'm borderline starving myself. Did you hear from Tony? Did he call? No. Nick either. I'm gonna go make us something to eat. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We don't know if it's safe. Honey, there's a cop car down the street watching out for us. I think that you're in the clear now. I think that Tony and Rick's playing don't. Worked. We don't know that. We don't. I just... Let it ring. If it's the cops, tell them you were sleeping. Hello? Rick, where are you? Are you all right? <laughs> I guess um, things went great over at the bus station. What happened? Tell me. Well, the uh, guy chasing them, they, they lost him on the way downtown. I think that uh, Tony's a pretty insane driver. Yeah, he is. And uh, Rick went into the bus station and I made a big fuss at the ticket window so that people would remember that you'd been there. Mm -hmm. And then he got on the bus to Cincinnati. He bailed at the first stop, um, but he left your jacket so that the police and your family would get a big fat arrow in the wrong direction. Where is he now? He's waiting for a cab. He's got to go back to the hospital. He's got two critical patients he's still covering for his friend. He he's going to check in on us mm -hmm. as soon as he can. He did a good job. 
Yeah. They didn't say anything else about... about Tony? Where he is? No, um... What happened to him? He left Tony at the bus station, but I'm sure he's gonna call. He'll be okay. I'm sick of being in that bed. Nobody's here, right? Uh, well, nobody. nobody now. But... Tony showed up. Along with the cops. Is, is he okay? Well, yeah. Um, it turns out that he got shot in the shoulder when he took uh, out that hitman. Is it bad? It's not life-threatening. Okay. Well, what next? Well, believe it or not, the FBI arrested Tony for conspiracy to commit murder. Frank and Harley insisted that he go to the hospital first, and they went along with him and the FBI. All right. I've got to get him a lawyer. Ross is on his way over there. Ross, what did you? Honey, thanks. Thank you. And Maida is at the lighthouse uh, preservation meeting. Robbie is uh, sleeping like a baby. <laughs> There's a squad car out front, and other than that, we are uh, the only ones here. Hey, come on, take it easy. What's the matter? You've got battle fatigue. Is that what it is? Mm-hmm. Ford Creek, so I jump. I don't dare let myself think about the future. What? Oh, come on, go ahead. Come here. You want five kids? That's what you said, right? <laughs> okay. We'll have them before or after your medical degree. Oh, God. That means we'll have to make that house at Laurel Falls a little bigger. <laughs> the other families are going to be out of our hair soon enough. It looks like your family is coming around with me. <sighs> Even though she probably didn't want to. Claire saved my life. And, uh... Rick really went out on a limb for me. We know where Maida stands. Mm -hmm. Tony, well, he wants out of the life. He can come work for me, and he can run the club when I want to be home with you and all those kids we're going to have. Mm -hmm. How's that sound? Of course, it would be funny if I get just run over by a bus after all this or food poisoning no, not from a bad hamburger. Not, not a chance. Not bad a chance. cow there's, disease. There's only a certain amount of bad luck that people can have. And we have used up all of ours from now on. It's smooth sailing. Okay. Do you want to relax a little bit? I'm going to try. You try? I'm going to work on it. Because we are going to be... Big, beautiful family. <laughs>